G'day guys, Lemon Eating Cow here, and today I'm back with some Final Fantasy 15, and more specifically, Episode Prompto. Now, I'm not sure if it's live all around the world at the moment, but I have definitely downloaded it on the Australian PSM. It is now um, quarter past midnight, so uh, if I'm looking a bit shabby and my voice is a bit off, uh, that's my excuse. Anyway, I've downloaded it and I'm going into the game now. Uh, and yeah, bonus content has been unlocked. So this is going to be my first playthrough of it. Um, please, guys, if there's any uh, problems with the audio or the visuals or anything, just let me know and I'll try and fix it up as soon as I can. Um, the audio may be a bit low. Anyway, yeah, I'm trying to... I want to make it a good experience for everybody involved. So uh, your feedback is important. Um... Yeah, so let's get into it. Welcome everybody in the chat. AK, um, I'm doing good. V gets mid deal. <clears throat> Downloadable content is highlighted. Boom. All right, let's get into it. Uh, my aim is going to be freaking terrible. But anyway, um, yeah, so this is in the Australian PSN. I'm not really sure. Oh, there it is. I'm not really sure when it's going to be worldwide released, but. Um, yeah, we'll see what happens. So, I think this goes without saying, there is going to be ginormous spoilers in this. So, uh, if you're not into that, then look away. But I think it's going to be a good experience. So, anyway, let's get into it. I'm going to try not to talk during the cutscenes, but um, yeah. Just let me know how the audio goes. If it's off, just, yeah. Yeah. Oh! <gasps> Ooh, so it looks like when you finish it, you get the time trial. We kind of thought or kind of knew that was going to happen. Um, I think that's a time trial of the snowmobile, which we'll see a little bit later on. And intensive training. That's one of the trophies that you have to beat. Um, you have to beat Aranea to get the trophy. So I'll just check everything's good here. Um, so yeah, I think that's going to be against Aranea. But anyway... Let's jump into it. It's it's already looking cool. Come on. It's already looking cool. Ooh, we'll go normal. Why not? I think there's a trophy attached to normal, so uh, yeah, let's do it. A schism splits the royal retinue when Noctis inadvertently pushes Prompto from atop a speeding freight liner. Seemingly betrayed by his best friend, Prompto surpass, suppresses feelings of sadness and trudges through the snow in search of answers. So if you have played in the story up to uh, like chapter 15, I think, um, or it happens around chapter 12 or 13, Noctis is kind of confuzzled by Arden and he thinks that Arden is uh, prompto. So he kind of pushes him off the top of the train. Um, as they say, inadvertently. He doesn't really know what's going on. I think his mind is all mush after the events in uh, Altitia. So, yeah, I think this is going to be a bit of a struggle with uh, Prompto. I'm guessing Arden's going to be in his ear and kind of saying like, man, Noctis doesn't want you. Noctis is your enemy. None of the bros want you. You're a failure. Uh, you're a test tube piece of crap. <laughs> Basically, I think they're going to do here we go. I don't know how you got the clothes, though. That's a mystery still. Several days after falling off the train, I guess. Oh, this is us. It's freezing out here. It's good. It, it's got the feeling of that really frigid, ice cold area already. I really like this costume. I hope we unlock it at the end. Uh, I'll be doing the time trial, and I think that's how we're going to unlock it. Oh, 
This kind of feels like the start of the game where you're pushing the car a little bit. <laughs> Do a prompto. I hope we get to see prompto like a strong character coming through here would be really really cool. I'm hoping they kind of give him some uh, aggression and um, self confidence. Don't give up, prompto. I've got a feeling this is going to be way better than episode Gladio, story-wise, anyway. Oh, come on, mate, you can do it. Getting Revenant vibes here. We just need a bear attack. <laughs> what a way to go! Oh, dude, man, that'd be chilly as. Above us! <laughs> Magitech soldiers? Or Imperials, rather. Boy, he's not looking good. Hang in there, Prompto. It'll be really good to see. Hey, wait, there's, um. There's Fat Prompto. When he was a kid, he was overweight. We're actually gonna, we might see his model in game. That's pretty cool. I'm also hoping that once we finish it, we're gonna get a teaser of episode Ignis. I hope. We may not, but I hope we do. I really do. Yeah, I just want uh, Aaron A to jump down and start busting the shit out of everybody. <laughs> and get some waifu action going. Oh, Plumpto. This is totally Plumpto. My whole life, all I ever wanted was friends. Looks like but me. No one <laughs> ever wanted me back. The chin and all. So when I finally found people who did want me, I did everything I could to make them stay. The bros. And ever since then, I've lived my life in fear. That one day they'd find out who I really was, and they wouldn't want me anymore. Yeah, there's a scene where he falls off the train. I don't know how he ended up in the snowy area though, if that was the scene where he fell off. <sighs> it's out in Australia. In Australia it's the 27th at the moment, just by about half an hour. So I'm not sure in other countries at all. It depends on where, when your console store updates. Uh, ours in Australia updates like one of the first. It's gone. Ooh, what's gone? His uh, wristband. Does he usually wear a wristband? I didn't notice in the game if he does. Oh, here we go. Life in, what? in captivity. Inspect what your surroundings. Place? All right. Uh, we'll check out our. Ooh, wow. Uh, this is really odd. The menu and everything is a little bit different. We don't have any, like, inventory, from what I can see. Um, we got no jump button either. None of our buttons seem to do anything at the moment. Research log. Research log, year 722, day 189. I received a proposal Bar regarding steel. a way to improve the infantry's performance by leaps and bounds. Outfit the troopers with Magitech cores. Preliminary mm. tests suggest sublimating demons for fuel will result in an unstable infantry unfit for the field. If the calculations he provided are correct, though, this could solve all our problems. 
The Deathless Project marks the advent of a new age. No longer will our soldiers fall on the field of battle. The Empire shall rise, and soon all the world shall bask in our glory. <sighs> he is maybe Arden that he's referring to? The he in italics? It's funny that he has a cassette player. It's really odd. But anyway. A new hope. Construction finished today on the first Magitech production facility. Rising military star and leading authority on Magitech, Bastille Bessithia, uh, has been selected to oversee the plant's operation. Reports say Bessithia will relinquish his field duties in order to serve at the compound full time. So... Big, big spoiler, block your ears if you don't want to hear it. Um, Versteel is basically um, Prompto's father. I'm not sure if it's like a test tube type of father or he's actual like biologically, but uh, we'll find out the exact um, source later on. No, nothing up here. I'm just, I'm gonna be pretty thorough the first time around. So yeah, I think we're pretty good. Oh, is that something? Give me. All right, let's go. Scanning production code. Oh, it's scanning Unit zero five nine five three two three four confirmed. Warning. Ooh. This unit has been compromised. What's going on? Initiating retrieval of compromised units. She still remembers you after all these oh, years. Oh, I'm. Huh? What gives? We can't have you spilling blood here. He's got his gun too. Although to most, this compound is known only as the first Magitech production facility. Such a great voice actor. Birthplace of the myriad Magitech troopers and demons the Empire holds dear. To you, this place should have some sentimental value after all. It is your home, sweet home. Ooh. Shut up. Shut up. I'm not the one who almost killed you. You're up. You really ought to take a rest. Mm. Perhaps the estimable Chief Basithia will help heal that broken heart of yours. Who the hell is that? Oh, how quickly they forget. But fear not. I've no doubt a reunion would refresh your memory. Yeah, so I definitely think that Arden is totally going to spin it the way... I'm going to find them. Wherever they are. I think Arden's going to spin it like Noctis hated you. He wanted to knock you off the train. And uh, he's going to try and turn us against the bros. Uh, so we've got our access to our text here. We've got selfie shot. We have to do 10 of those for an achievement in battle. And we got our star shell. Also, we got our weapon wheels. And we got potions. Oh, dude. What a cool menu. Wow. Map. Uh, not much of a map yet. Gear. What do we got in the way of gear? Prompto. Handgun. Ordax blade. Okay, I think that's like a um, a baton, pretty much. A mechanical sword designed to use in facilities where firearms are prohibited. The blade flips out upon activation. Ooh. And Tundra Attire. I think that's what we're going to unlock. Wicked. Anyway, I'm, I'm keen as, man. Let's get into it. Archives, photos. Can I shoot yet? Oh, yeah, there we go. Cool, man. Lights out! Dude, it's it's gonna be a bit weird. It's gonna have a really serious tone. I hope he's not like, hey, dude, dude, and doing his uh, catchphrases all the time, but we'll see how it goes. Okay, we got a tented area up there too. And we can sneak as well. You can like <sighs> stealth kill people and stuff. A vending machine, ebony vending machine. <laughs> okay, I wonder if... Oh, classic jump. Dude. Classic jump thing. You go to press X and it... Whatever. Anyway. Um, yeah, wicked. Alright, save your progress. Totally. We've done so much. Anyway, hopefully... Oh, it says we're level 34 as well. So I think it's going to lock our level. 
here. High potion. Alright, so we'll see what this does. I think we can stealth up behind people and like break necks and stuff. Uh, it's half past 12 or half past midnight here, so that's on the 27th. So that's why this one is uh, available here. Okay, Imperial soldiers are patrolling the area. Equip the handgun with up on the D-pad, then shoot them with the R1. The handgun will never run out of ammo, so fire away. Alright. Lands three shots with the... Uh... Oh shit. How do I target? Bring it on! <laughs> cool man. It feels it feels really good. Let's get some baton action going. Oh, smack him. Okay. It feels the gun gunplay feels pretty good. I already did that, buddy. Uh we get later on we get like a submachine gun and bazookas and everything, so it should be pretty cool. Oh, hi there, opening. Yeah, we're totally gonna hear that one. Ooh, heaps of Magitek. Shit. Was he telling the truth about this place? He said a naughty word. This set piece looks great. I love, I love the look of this scene here. Phoenix down, all right. Uh, what do we got? I'm, I want to look for all the audio files and stuff as well. Give us a bit of uh, context. Prefix log, year 722, day 294. I acted on the proposal mentioned in my log of day 189. My attempts to infuse the troopers' magitech cores with demonic, demonic energy. energy. Definitely are. Only in the most basic sense, however. While the soldiers are indeed deathless, they are far from fit for fighting. Thus, I've decided to take a different approach. Rather than relying on demons to power the Magitek infantry, why not use humans mm. instead? Frankly, I had never considered employing my fellow man in any Magitek-related experiments. But countless men and women succumb to the Plasmodia each day. Rather than let them die victims of an ignominious disease, why not help them ascend to nobler heights? I've lost many a comrade on the field of battle, and I've no intention of allowing any more of their deaths to go in mm. vain. <sighs> How could he even think of using those innocent people for his twisted experiments? Um, I think the Plasmodia, maybe that's a Star Scourge? I, I haven't really heard that reference before. Oh shit. Approaching <gasps> undetected and deliver a stealth kill. Alright, let's do it. Uh, we'll see if I can get the command right. <laughs> I'm probably gonna totally noob it up, but anyway. X is stealth kill. Oh, not too bad. I think we have to get three of them for an achievement. And we have to get some selfies going too. Ooh, I picked up his submachine gun. Stealth kill Imperial soldiers to kill, uh, to steal their weapons. Yeah, if you guys don't want to stick around for the stream because you don't want to spoil it, I completely understand. So, yeah, no hard feelings. Thanks for dropping by anyway. If you could leave a like before you go, that'd be pretty nice though. <laughs> kids well I think that's how um, how things turn for a prompto then okay I'll check down here uh, nothing much here but yeah Vastil it sounds like maybe get a hold of prompto when he was quite young and maybe injected him or did whatever he did with the uh, demons miasma everything about oh, this shit. place gives me the creeps can I stealth kill these duties no, I think they're ready for me. Ready your submachine gun by holding L1. Tilt, ding to aim. Okay. 
The crosshairs will turn orange when an enemy is in your sights and green when you can target an enemy's weak point. Oh, okay. Let's do this. I would assume that's their head. How did I get spotted? Come on. Take that, buddy. The, the weak spot didn't seem to do all that much right. extra damage, though. Vulnerable enemies are temporarily incapacitated. Capitalize on this opportunity and land a powerful strike. Press triangle to deliver a devastating crack shot against the valued vulnerable enemy, or approach and press X to deliver an overkill strike and steal their weapon. Ooh. Okay, let's try it out. Get it? Overkill? Oh, <laughs> cool man. Kicked him in the face and took his gun. I think you've got limited ammo with these weapons too, so maybe that's a part of, oh shit, stealing their weapons. Am I? No. no I'm totally. Let's do the other one, the, uh, the overkill-y thing. Oh, crack shot. Boom. Shot him straight in the head. So the combat doesn't seem too technical or uh, advanced at the moment, but um, it feels good. God damn, picking up items is torture. Uh, I'm gonna rest, because I... doesn't look like I can. Anyway. Uh, I'm gonna get a couple of selfies in battle too, because I want to see that shit. Land 20 shots with the Rapidus. Okay. Oh, it looks like there's explodable barrels too. Ooh. Detonate explosives to inflict damage. But I need to get 20 shots into these guys. Maybe it was a bad idea doing that. Shit. Anyway, oh no, we got heaps more. Yeah, yeah. I want to try and get these missions done, so. Here I go! Overkill? Boom. Give me ammo, buddy. I'll get some melee action going. Oh. oh, he's already dead. He's already dead. Rapidus SMG. Steal stray weapons strewn about the facility for extra firepower. Mm. Uh, for anyone that is wondering and then just joined the stream, I'm in Australia and we tend to get the updates the earliest. So if you can't get it in your country yet, it's probably going to be available in about 12 hours or so or whenever you're... Um, PlayStation Store or whatever uploads or uh, refreshes, I guess. Alia Bazooka. Holy crap. <laughs> Press to equip your new recoilless rifle, the Alia Bazooka. Three bullets, though. Same deal with aiming. This is, uh, this is a bit crazy. I want to get stealth kills, though. I need them. Let's see if we can sneak around now. There's SMG, so I'll try out this bazooka at least. Oh. Oh, this is, might be where we get the sniper rifle or something. One of the enemy possesses a sniper rifle, there you go. Steal the weapon and use it to turn the tables. Nice. Okay, we're gonna try... Land two shots with the sniper. Is that the sniper? Oh, there it is right there. That's a bit... weird. Why would they tell us the enemy has it if they're just gonna give it to us? Oh, whatever. Oh. Man, that's brutal! He's like, haha! And he's like, breaking some dude's neck. <laughs> that's, uh, that's not very prompto-ish. Okay, let's see if we can get a shot on this dude. Oops. Whoa, that is freaking loud, man. They could at least give us a silencer. Did that hit him? Did... What? Is that a dude? Are they training dummies or something? Oh. I, oh, shit. There's a guy right here. <laughs> Why can't he see us? Maybe there's a bit... Maybe the uh, stealth system isn't quite perfect yet, huh? <laughs> oh well. We still need, I think, like one more stealth kill? Do we need the bazooka? 
defense node. I thought that said defense noodle. I was like, what the frig is a defense noodle? If a defense node detects an intruder, it will activate a dormant Magitech troopers in the area. Ah. Put all your skills to good use and clear the area. Target detected. Eliminate immediately. Commence elimination of compromise. Oh shit. Wow. Alright, so don't run next to the nodes. They are dangerous. Jeebus, man. Okay, I'm gonna pick up the bazooka. Uh, I don't... I don't want none of your shit. Whoa! No! Not good! This is not good. You're right, buddy. <laughs> Holy shit! That is pretty good. Um, you have to wait a while for the, um, the bazooka to kick in, like zero in, I guess. Oh, give me your shit, buddy. Hey! Holy far out. They do, like, big damage, man. This is only a normal as well. Alright. Oh, let's get a, um... Far out. That nukes them. Crack shot. Okay. Let's get a uh, tech off on this guy. We'll get a selfie. <laughs> we got a crotch shot of him. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Do we get anything else? We'll try a star shell as well. It's over. Star shell blinds enemies with a brilliant flash of light, reducing their stats. Okay. Oh, shit. And if this is like... Well, that doesn't do much damage at all. Um, get the crack shot on him. No? Alright. If this is like episode um, Gladiolus, we're probably going to get like an extra skill once we finish it, like a tech skill. I've just got to find my way out. Yeah, pick up the sniper rifle. Um, yeah, I think this is going to take a bit of practice to get used to. It feels a little bit clunky at the moment, a little bit, but. That's just because I'm not all that great. Lumen Flare. Press to equip a new grenade, the Lumen Flare. Ooh. Ready the grenade by pressing R1, tilt to aim, R1 to throw. Okay, pretty cool. Grenades. Hopefully there's quite a few varieties of them. Anything else around here? No secrets? Alright. Um, anyway, let's move on. Yeah, it'll take a bit of getting used to, totally. I'm not sure how long this one's gonna go for. I can't see it going for like an hour or two. I think this leads back to the same area, but maybe a different item or something? Yeah. Elixirs. I think I'm gonna need them, because I'm getting thrashed already, so... It looks really cool, it does. I, I cannot wait. We still gotta meet Aranea as well, so... Pumped. Um... Alright, buddy. <laughs> I totally get a uh, Metal Gear Solid 1 feeling when uh, Snake is trying to take out Sniper Wolf. I'm totally getting that feeling. And he totally gets smacked off his head on Diazepan. Hold, hold. Let's take in the view. Uh, not much of a view, actually. Huh. Alright. Cool, man. I'm, I'm digging it. I'm feeling it already. I wonder how good or how bad the snowmobile section is going to be. That'll be the clincher, I think. Hello, opening. We haven't heard that one yet. Oh, dude, just pick it up, please. <laughs> I'll hold the button from now on, I think. Prototype numbering instructions. In order to better monitor the large number of new Magitech models entering production, the Imperial Defense Council motions to reform the coding system as follows. Troopers, five-digit model number plus eight-digit production, and infants, four-digit production year plus eight-digit production code. I don't know what, uh, I've, I've already forgotten what, uh, Prompto's code was, so. We've hey, the same little kidder. Thank you very much for joining the stream, and thank you very much for the super chat, little kidder. Ten bucks, thank you. 
Final Fantasy 15 and L.E.K. again. Yeah, good to see you back, little kidder. I didn't think you'd be tuning in for this one, but... Lots of spoilers ahead. Year 723, day 70. I pondered how I might find the necessary number of infants. And then it dawned on me. Why not make them? Oh, dude. If I clone them Why not make them? Genes, I can eliminate the pesky process of breeding them. Mass production remains a pipe dream for now, but I'm confident I can create a massive infantry once the process Infantry? If everything goes according to plan, the Empire will boast a million-man army in no time at all. <laughs> all this time, those things I've been fighting have been... <laughs> oh yeah, this is why in the little teaser clip that we got that Prompto is like crying, shooting that Magitek soldier. <laughs> He knows where they came from, so I think that's where his hurt came from. I don't think it's going to be anyone special under that hood, but you can understand he's pretty much killing, like, test tube humans. It's it's horrible. Oh, that's a really good shot. Really good solemn one, or... Next? Alright. I must see all. It's, it's pretty good so far. I'm liking it. I'm just going to make heaps of save files. I'm gonna try and read everything, so yeah. Good day, Shrikan. It seems my laboratory is not nearly as secure as I once believed. Some thief, likely a Lucian, made off with one of my experiments. Mm. Absconding with a single infant will do nothing to enlighten them of the grandeur of my research. Is that, that prompt on? I will see to it such an incident never arises again. I've posted Magitek troopers around the facility and instructed them to keep a vigilant watch. It is their home after all. The kingdom kidnapped one of those infants? I think that's... Does that mean I... Yeah. No, it couldn't be. There's no way. Well, the sniper rifle looks really cool too. So I'm guessing it's Prompto that got kidnapped, but I'm not really sure by who. Oh shit. Oh. Into face. The Magitek soldiers remind me of something out of Wizard of Oz. Oh, the music, man. Getting into it. Target detected. Eliminate immediately. Is the volume okay for you guys? Everything's running okay? Oh, these guys are healing up too. Commence elimination of compromised unit. Whoops, wrong button. Oh, they're undercover and everything. Shit, that did a lot of damage still. Bang. We got a dude over here too. Oh, nice! So you can use those to take out enemies as well. We've still got one dude popping up here. Oh, no, get him! Yes. We have the uh, flashbang as well. Are there other ones down there? No, okay, I'll grab the Rapidus. Oh. oh, another Lumen Flare. We'll try one out in the next bit, actually. Pick it up, Prompto. Please? No? You don't... Alright, there he goes. <laughs> I guess the enemy, uh, sorry, the Ebony looks like it gave us a food buff as well. Uh, Lexi, yeah, I have tried the um, Regalia Type D. It's uh, I got a few videos up on the channel, actually. That sniper rifle is goddamn powerful. Oh shit. Do they know I'm here? Bring it yeah. on. Alright, I'm gonna try and take out that No. Before they sneak up behind me, there we go. Get out of there, mate. I gotta get selfies as well. The axe dudes are coming down here, I think. I'll try throwing the grenade. Whoops. <laughs> oh, it, it disappeared. Ah, oh, it's an actual explosive. Oh, that's right on me. Whoa, it did like nothing. Oh, but it, um, like stunned him. Okay. <laughs> Keen to see that one. I'll check how. I think if these stun, they're pretty powerful. Crack shot him. 
No, I'm like executing. Oh, I can't. Right These guys are a bit odd. I suppose if you don't have a good weapon, they could be hard to take out, but yeah. What else we got? I think I took most of the other guys out with that. Oh. Can I stealth kill him? No, I totally don't. Oh, you can't you can't aim the pistol. It's just a straight up fire, basically. Get in there. Yeah. Oh, I should have overkilled him for his weapon. Oh. Wait. There's a sniper rifle right next to me too, I think. Shit, get out of there, buddies. Oh, this is pretty hardcore. There's like enemies everywhere. Maybe I can stun them with the. Uh, So I'm just gonna kill these guys. Oh crap. Anyway. <laughs> uh we'll try some star shell on them. It's over. Blind them a bit. Well, I thought it blind them. Anyway. Oh, <laughs> oh shit. In the face. Nice. I like the sniper rifle. There's not near enough uh, ammo in it, though. Smile, buddy. <laughs> yeah, the hell out of there. I I'm digging the um, switching weapons and doing the overkill and stuff like that. Is the game audio a bit too high? Is that is that what's going on? I really like the rifle. I'm going to keep that shit. Oh, you guys are talking to someone else. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, that is the wrong direction. Uh, where am I going? Here. Alright, yeah, I'm pretty damn scrubby at the combat so far, but we're getting by, so... Lumen Flare, we'll grab a couple of those. The flares all seem alright, but they seem really, really clunky to throw. Yeah, I'm totally ready to see Aranea. <laughs> Lucky me. Lucky me. I love his outfit, but if we get that in the game, it's not going to make any sense that he's wearing this stuff like in the middle of the desert. But I suppose pretty much none of their outfits the make sense. Uh, Uncle Wright, I would believe that the star shell is rebalanced for this one, but I could be wrong. But it would make sense for it's better for the demons, yeah. Oh, how could he it's do real that? people. Who? What am I? Wayne, it's the 27th here in Australia, so it makes sense. It's also the 27th in Japan right now. The following specimens have been eradicated. Holy shit. Wow, that's... That's prompto. Wow, crazy. All 23 samples listed have been incinerated to avoid potential demification of personnel. Holy fire out. That's intense. So I guess these guys, once they start forming hair, they're actually going to look like Prompto. Can we shoot the... Uh... No, it doesn't look like we can shoot them at all. Wow, that's that's pretty hardcore. 
Is somebody in there? Ooh, it's Vastil and Arden. <laughs> Deep breaths. Nice, man. Nice. It'll be good to see a bit more. Arden, even if I don't see more of his story, his voice is fantastic. It's so good. Can we listen in? Yeah, here we go. My friend, do you recall the child who was stolen from this facility? <sighs> the one those Lucians absconded with? Precisely. I thought you might like to see the fine young man he's become these 20 odd mm, years later. We were the stolen one. So as thanks for bringing your pets to insomnia, I've brought the boy to you. The time has come to meet your maker. Any questions for Daddy Dearest? Oh, he totally knows we're there. Father and son. Oh, how I love <laughs> bringing families together. No, it's not true. You're wrong, damn it! Good emotion in his voice. I wonder if Prompto was the only one that really succeeded. The rest are kind of like stuck in their demified states, and Prompto is the only real success. Confront Vastil. Ooh. Vastil? Vastil? I don't care what he says. This place will never be my home. No, it's my home late, mate. is in Lucis. Not here. I like it. His his voice act is really going to get into it. I think. Day Finally, my demon-infused Magitek armor is complete. I have christened my creation Diamond, Diamond Weapon. Weapon. It has exhibited an extremely unstable psyche, immediately unleashing unmitigated horrors upon activation. Destructive capabilities, however, are indeed beyond compare. Not even the impenetrable insomnia could withstand this onslaught. <laughs> Why, the crowd city would fall in a mere matter of minutes. The stone of legend will soon be mine. To think that in less than a month's time, the crystal will be mine to play with as I please. So he's the one behind the attack mm. on insomnia. Which is Kingsglaive, basically. He planned the whole thing. Everything we lost that day is gone because of him. So I guess that means, or that's confirmation, that the weapon that attacked Kingsglaive or Insomnia during Kingsglaive was the diamond weapon. Which, hopefully, if they're actually talking about it, maybe we're going to see it in this game at some point. That would be kick-ass. I wonder what the Japanese translation of diamond weapon will be, because often the translations can kind of give you if it's not directly translated or literally translated, it can give you a bit of extra insight or loss of insight. There we go. Diamond Weapon Report. Attention His Imperial Majesty Leodus or Ideolus. Idolus? Sorry. Aldercraft? 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 It is with great pride I inform your radiance that the development has finished of the new demon armor codenamed Diamond Weapon. So, Diamond Weapon was a weapon from Final Fantasy VII, which uh, one of the super bosses from it. I encourage your Radiance to visit the first production facility at your Radiance's earliest convenience. I am most confident the final product will prove to your Radiance's liking. Dude, I hope, I hope they do something extra with that. I really do. I want to see Diamond Weapon in the game. Yeah, I'm Australian. That's why we've got it early. It is the 27th here. It is 1 a.m. in the morning, so yeah. There's a couple people living here still. <laughs> a couple. Ooh. What's the matter? Have you never seen a man turn before? Ooh. He becomes quite messed up if later. Those Lucians hadn't intervened. You could have Why turned me? too. Because you were cloned from this genius's genes, born of my own flesh and blood. You are but one of millions, created to serve our great empire in the Magitech Infantry. To serve you? Yes. And now you've finally come home to Niflheim, 
my son. Shut up! <laughs> you should have put the bullet into him. You're wrong. I'm a Lucian! Do it. I am not one of your experiments! Not anymore. Now, you're Ooh. nothing but a failure. Ouch. I ought to return you whence you came. Perhaps then you might serve some use. Never! Oh, shoot him, do it. <laughs> With your help, my ascension to divinity is now all but complete. Soon, neither the kings of Lucis nor the gods themselves will be able to challenge my reign. Resist. I wonder what happens if you don't press that command. I will go back and try it, but I had to press it then. You shall become as god, mate. Don't worry about it. You ascended to nothing. <gasps> Look what you've done. <laughs> you've gone homicidal. Um, no, patricidal. Patricidal. No. You lose your friends and murder your family. <laughs> Now you bastard. <laughs> shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Vital functions decreasing. Plasmodium activity index increasing. Oh, he's getting Demonification complete. Initiating transfer to unit XDA 1002. Immortalis. Ooh. Is he going to turn into the behemoth, maybe? Maybe he'll be the Kaiser behemoth. Oh! You always play hard to get like this? Here comes Bay. Aranea. Yeah. Aranea? Save it, Blondie. On your feet. <laughs> Save it, Blondie. I love her outfit. It looks awesome. So, this is that new model they're working on. I don't know what's got you so shook, but you can deal with it later. Let's move. <laughs> She's not going to take any crap there. I'm only going to say this once. Lose your will to live and you lose all hope of me helping your sorry ass. Got it? Oh, she's taller than him too. Maybe she's got heels on. Yeah, she does. Dude. <laughs> Can we kick out Barnum? Kick him. Oh, there's bombs here. Let's get the hell out. Oh, oh, shit. Shit. I wonder if we have to kill these guys. Aranea, wait up! Is she around here? Ah, oh, snowmobile time too. Wicked, wicked. Okay, let's start taking these dudes down. Whoops! Shit, they're everywhere. I'm thinking we're probably gonna just have to escape. No! No, no, no! Move it! Okay, yeah. Definitely gonna have to just escape, I think. Get in there, Prompto. Get him. No, can't do it. Alright. I think we, I'm just gonna get to the, um... Yeah, crap on this. I don't think we can take it. Aaron A can do it. Oop, I'm gonna get a selfie though. Like a dragon die, dragoon die. Prompto can call upon Aaron A to deliver powerful aerial attack that we cannot see right now. <laughs> anyway, uh, I did it in two close quarters, I think. Let's get out of here. Holy shit! There is stuff everywhere right now. We're making a break for it. We can't kill all these dudes at all. In fact, just one second before I go. <laughs> this is very important stuff right here. <laughs> Bit of selfie action. Man, she's just taking them all. No, up there. 
Get interrupted really easy. Uh, oh. Head there. I'll catch up later. Uh, but <laughs> she's what too about cool. You? I said I'll catch up. But, what Just go. Now we'll get to see how either great or terrible this snowmobile action is. I hope it's great. I really do. Prompto will take damage when hit while riding the snowmobile. When HP is low, hop off and use a restorative to recover health. All right. X is to hop on and off, R2 is speed up, L2 is slow down, steer and circle is jump. L1 to adjust view, look around, hold square to fire while driving. Ooh, okay, Oh, It sounds pretty poxy though. <laughs> oh shit, whoa, it is super glary, I cannot see anything. Shooting is a bit odd. You have to like hold down the button. Yeah, take that bastard. This, um, I don't know, the shooting to me is uh, not great at the moment. Holy shit. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, if I can sort the shooting out, there's a really big delay in it though. Well, we've got unlimited bullets, so... Oh, there's a Magitek engine up there, too. Can we take the high road? Oh, oh shit! Get out of there, mate! <laughs> um... Whoa. It's a little bit dodgy. Just a little bit. Okay, we'll see what the... <laughs> see what the camera angles are like. Alright, not so nice. Yeah, I think we'll stay here. Looks like there's going to be multiple directions and stuff with the, uh... Shoot him. Wang! It feels very James Bondy at the moment. <laughs> it's a little bit dodge, but, you know, I like it. I appreciate the effort. It's going to be hard as to do the time attack, I reckon, though. Yeah, yeah. Oh shit. Because in the time attack you have to collect like um, different coins and stuff that are around the track, so yeah. How long have we been going? We've been going about 45 minutes so far, so yeah. Hopefully we've got about another 45 minutes, maybe? Behemoth? This ride isn't timed, but there is a timed mode, I think. I'm sorry if it feels like I'm ignoring chat, but I'm focused on the game. Um, yeah. Catch you later, Aranea. Aranea? Is he giving up already? Surely not. Come on, mate. I want him to take the reins and just become like this um, bullet demon or something. Oh. <laughs> I was about to throw this goddamn controller out the window. I thought that was the entire thing complete. I was like, what is this bullshit? But it looks like we're continuing. Wow. I, I thought that was it. <laughs> that's good. I, I'm, uh, that's good. I would have raged hard if that was the end of it. <laughs> I wonder if there's going to be collectibles around here. There doesn't seem to be... Whoop. Oh, there's enemies and everything. Holy shit. Maybe there's guns here. Yeah, it looks like there's guns. Oh shit, there's really fast dude too. 
Level 34. Flexi Tusk, is it? Yeah. Oh, where is he? Take that, you bastard. Uh, who else have you got? Oh, the zoom is weird. But anyway. It doesn't quite zoom where you think you're looking. It kind of just goes, yeah, I'll zoom here. Oh, you're gonna get beat, dog. But not before. <laughs> Prompto is beating animals. He's beating dogs with a stick and taking photos of himself doing it. So he's a great guy. Lumina Flare. I hope we get other types of um, grenades. We've only seen the one so far, the Lumen Flare. Hopefully we get some like concussive grenades or some incendiary ones. Good scenery. Like it's it's kind of washed out, but it's uh, not looking too bad. I don't reckon there would be any like secrets in here, and there's no achievements from collecting all the items or anything. So I think we'll just may head on for the main the main story, and then afterwards we can do time attack modes and uh, face Aranea and all that type of stuff. Sorry, buddies, no time. We don't level or anything, so I don't... I don't know if there's really any point in fighting them. I don't think there is. Wait for Aranea at camp? Okay. What I'm gonna do just quickly, um, I'm gonna check out the trophies for a second. Uh, is it overview? G'day to those people playing. Um, sorry to break the flow, but I'm gonna have a quick look. Stealth kill, three of them. 30 enemies with crack shots. Okay, so I'm going to do a lot of crack shots. Completed on normal. Beat the behemoth. Okay, pretty pretty standard stuff. So I guess I'm going to do a lot of crack shots. And a couple more stealth kills. Otherwise, it's pretty standard stuff, I think. Alright, what's going on? Alright. Am I meant to be not on the snow here? I guess so. Ooh, Aranea, maybe it's bath time. Bath time! Maybe we'll have a bath together. Giggity. Uh, Crane? I do not read Japanese. But it looks like there's no punctuation in there. Mmm. Almost as good as what Iggy used to make. <laughs> I doubt it. Well, <laughs> at least it's quiet for a change. <laughs> the DLC is pretty good so far. It's got a good storyline. The action, yeah, it's cool. There's something different. <laughs> Bath time. Oh, do don't it. do it, mate. You need it. Oh, dude, he needs that to access the facility and everything. Oh, he really hates himself, eh? Oh, dude, give up. I don't want to burn it. No way, he needs it to access the rest of the stuff. Don't hurt yourself, mate. Does giving up mean, like, giving up hope, or does it just mean... Uh, what the hell am I thinking? Don't tell me you thought that would work. <laughs> uh, uh, I think if you burn it, it doesn't do anything anyway, by the sounds of that. Right? Oh, she's cute, man. Apparently she's like 30 plus as well, which makes her even, even more cute. You could at least look happy to see me. I ran into your buddies in Tenebrae. You've got them worried sick. You gonna go see him or what? Uh, 
I... I can't. <sighs> she looks awesome in that outfit. I love I it. I can't. I'm not like them. I was born here. In Niflheim. All this time. And I've never told them. And that's not even the worst part. I wasn't born into a happy family. I was made, created in some laboratory. The entire reason I exist is to make Noct and all of them miserable. But he hasn't. How could I possibly see them? They never accept the real me. You spent all that time driving around together, and you still don't know what kind of guys they really are. Prompto uh, uh, hated himself for four years. Your princely pal and I weren't always on such friendly terms. But you know what? He put all that aside and asked me to make sure you were safe. Ah, knocked his ass. He did? Think he'd do that for someone who makes him miserable? Huh. Ask about me. I'll ask about the guys. Me sounds a bit selfish. Is everybody okay? All things considered, I guess. <laughs> sounds like they've been through a lot since you left, but they're still dead set on getting to the capital. <sighs> Hope they make it. They'd have a better shot with you around. A better shot? <laughs> Bit of pun there. <laughs> Lolly Osborne, I kinda hope they F. Nice. Classy. <laughs> uh, did they say anything else about me? Hmm, not that I can recall. Huh. Right. <laughs> His Highness was so worried about you he could barely speak. But don't worry. I whipped him into shape. <laughs> Her voice is so sultry. So, he doesn't hate me after all. Look, I can tell you want to get back together with him. So why not let them know? You think they'd let me back? Damn, those pants. After all this? Even if they did let me back, I'd probably cause them nothing but trouble. I'll prompt though. I don't know how I could live with myself. <laughs> because you're doing such a great exactly. job of living with yourself. Uh, uh, what do you want then? You worry uh, so much about what uh, other I... people want from you, you don't even know what you want anymore. Your life isn't yours to live. Forget about what everyone else thinks for a second and figure out what it is you're really after here. What a champion. I'm going after that new model in the morning. You're on your own now, kid. Good stuff. He needs some tough love. He totally needs some tough love. He would totally have a boner right now too. Sadness or not, there'd be one poking through. He'd definitely be pitching a tent tonight. <laughs> that's that's part of the reason why I never identified with um, I never identified with Prompto. He has such self-loathing. He like hates himself so much. Even before he found out about the um. The whole Magitek thing, he just hated himself and he's always like <laughs> nervous and like, oh, do I fit in and all this stuff? Like, I get the isolation and stuff, but he's just, he takes it way too far. He just, he hates himself. And it's a really weak characteristic. Follow the barking. Ooh, okay. Doggy style? Yeah, no. Um, follow the barking, is that Umbra? 
I know this is in the way, but we'll have a look. See if there's any files up there or anything crazy. <laughs> Her bubble butt bootalicious cheeks is over 9,000. Eh, I would say maybe like 8,500. I don't know about over 9,000. Uh, seems pretty straightforward here. Someone said that we should come back and have a look for missions and stuff on the map. Um, it depends. If they take ages, I'm not really going to bother with them. Uh, purely because, I don't know, maybe they just fill up. Upgrade the snowmobile. What the hell? How do we do that? Speed boost, jump boost, damage boost, stability boost. Wow. CPU stock, zero. What is with that? We try a speed boost. Ah, dude. So we can get CPUs off enemies. I guess that gives us a um, an incentive now to do side missions. Well, there you go. That's pretty cool. Yeah, an hour plus in and it's just started pretty much. So I think it's going to be like at least two hours. Side quests are separate adventures that do not progress the story. Complete these quests to earn materials used to enhance your snowmobile. Side quests are scattered around the snowdrifts, so have a look around. However, some side quests are only available during a certain time of day. This is intense! When they talked about side quests, I thought it was just going to be like, um, shoot this dude three times or, you know, that type of stuff. But this is pretty full on. It looks like the Kaiser Behemoth might be a side quest as well. And only available during certain times. That's, that's intense. <laughs> um, alright, this feels a little bit cheap, but anyway. I gotta crack shot a lot of enemies, don't I? Sorry, buddy. It feels so bad, like, ever since we got the, um, Regalia type beat, we've been, like, shooting animals and running over them and all sorts of crazy stuff. Ride the snowmobile. Alright, let's go. This is, this is good, man. I, I hope you guys enjoy it when you finally get your hands on it. Anyway, let's go. Uh, we'll head towards... Yellow one is a side quest, I guess. We'll check that out. I'll probably get my ass schooled, but anyway. Ugh, man. I've been, um, pushing little cars around with my daughter all day. So I'm used to the... The car noise. <laughs> oh, they're totally ganging this dude. Oh, maybe I'll do one of these. And then crack shot them. Oh, yeah, that's the way to go. Yeah, take that, buddy. You ain't got shit. Nice. That's a cool little finisher. I like how everything kind of darkens down as well for it. Oh, take that. We saved the little, um... The little cow thingy there. Alright, so they appear at different times of the day, so I'm guessing there's going to be, like, little side quests popping up here and there, all over the map. But I kind of want to push on, I don't want to be waiting around too long. Um, I'll do guides and I'll come back and do it all later. I just rode over this dude. I'll do guides and stuff later on anyway. Sorry, buddy. I didn't mean to run over you there. I'm your brother. <gasps> I wonder if Prompto is going to be underneath the mask. Maybe if we take off the green thing, it's going to be like our face there. Because they're clones of us. Or maybe they've been demonified, I don't know. Interesting. Oh, I got no coffee left. God damn it. You can run them over, but it does very little damage, so. Oh. I think this might be Arden. Oh 
Holland Viking flee from Noctis. Oh, dude, this is wicked. Oh, cool, we got like super run mode too. Oh, he's warp striking us and everything. This will be quick. <laughs> dude, this is awesome. Uh, you're a bit too slow there, Noctis. Who's the dog? It has to be Umbra, surely. Oh, that's a white dog. Ah, oh, Priner. That means, um... Gientria? Is it Gientia? And Gentina? I don't know her name. Shiva. Maybe she's gonna be in this. G'day, Doge. Yeah, that's um that's Luna Freya's dog, right? Gentiana. Yeah, sorry. My pronunciation is terror bad. It is. It's fucking it's shocking. Woof woof. Let's go, doggles. Yeah, let's play in the snow. Oh, dude, there's Magitek everywhere. Are they gonna rise up? Can we teabag? <laughs> no, we can't teabag. Oh, yeah, we probably could. Oh, yeah, buddy. Sorry, that's immaturity. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, this is kind of like from the teaser, almost. It's similar. Single tear down the face. Hmm. This is from the teaser. Although the scene was slightly different in the teaser. So it's confirmation there wasn't anyone important under the mask, apart from Prompto himself, I guess, in some form. Reconnect with your inner child. Man, that's that's pretty heavy for, for Prompto, eh? He would be just getting, like, smashed with all these revelations right now. Like, it would be hard. It's Plumpto. Hello, Plumpto. Back in Insomnia. Oh. There's a text messaging dog. <laughs> All I ask is that Ooh. you continue to support Luna. Noctis and that you remain ever at his side. How does she expect someone like me to support him? Am I good enough? Huh, <laughs> cool. Does he want me around? Is that really no, what Noct and everyone else want? For me to be with them? Ah, oh, that's before we go to Altisha. Wait, but what about me? What do I want? It took me a while, but I finally found my answer. It's time. Oh, 
Well, he came, he turned himself around pretty bloody quick, eh? That could totally be a, um, an ad for the camera. Prompto could just look at the screen and be like, Camera, reconnect with your childhood. Aranea. Don't leave us, baby. I thought about what you said, and I've decided to face my fears once and for all. Good on you, mate. I can't choose where I came from, but I can choose where I'm going. All right. But slow me down and you're going to get left behind. <laughs> uh, she's awesome. So everybody in chat, do you reckon we're going to get a... Um, do you reckon we're going to get a teaser trailer for episode Ignis at the end? It'd be bloody cool if we do. Okay, uh, any other thingies around? No. So, we haven't started getting CPUs yet, I don't think. So, um... Oh, that is wicked. She's riding side saddle too, is she? No. Her outfit looks... Dude, it is so kick-ass. I love it. Huh. The textures on it are pretty good. Oh, take that, buddy. We'll see what Aranea can do, huh? And we'll get some crack shots off on these guys as well. Boom! We're doing link strikes. Awesome. Hey, you're not so worthless. <laughs> he, she says while I'm on the ground getting my ass beat. Crack shot. Oh. Not half bad. We're like one step closer to um, getting playable Aranea. Like, they're totally filling out her link strikes, her everything, so... She's totally gonna be playable soon. Yeah, yo. Whoop, shit. <laughs> no, um... No side quests this time of day, but... No. They'll come. Ooh, a little tower. Maybe you can snipe up there. Alright. This is it. I'm going in. Yeah, Arane is awesome, man. Totally digging it. And music too. Ugh. Secure the area? Oh, can I get some stealth kills? I need to get, like, one more stealth kill, I think. Yeah, I'm in the future right now. I'm like a day in the future. Ask me anything. I know lotto numbers and all that. Uh, I really want to get the stealth kill for the, um, the achievement. Hopefully that other dude doesn't see me, though. It'd be good if we got little blips on our map, but... Yeah, this is like, um, Metal Gear Hard Mode, where you don't get a little, uh, radar. This should give me the achievement, I think. That's three, right? Give me an achievement. No, it's not gonna do it. God damn. That should have given me the achievement. Poor bastards. Oh, there he goes. Unseen assassin. Oh, Jolly dude. Don't even say that. How dare you. Jolly says, I hope this Aranea is not Arden in disguise. That would kill me, man. That would kill me. Yoink. I... Because then I'd feel really guilty about my half chub this whole time. <laughs> really guilty. <laughs> oh, we can snipe the barrels back there, it looks like. Oh, do we use a bazooka or do we use the rifle? I'm gonna bazooka that shit. Oh, probably shouldn't shoot like that. Oh, do you reckon we'd shoot ourselves if we do that? Whatever, I'm game. Really? <laughs> Did 
that shit just happen? Did you guys see that? <laughs> oh, Square Enix. Yeah, yeah. At least that one worked. The, um... Ready or not. Oh, shit. There's dudes everywhere. Wow. Oh, look at that headshot skill. What, what can we take out? We'll get him over here and then we'll blow up that barrel, huh? Keep coming. Oof. Oh, they can hit me from here. Bastards. Got him. I'm all out. My hope it's unlimited. Aim, 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 aim. Yeah, take that, boys. Oh, Aranea, you're in trouble. I'll help you out. No, I don't know what she's doing, actually. We gotta get some more crack shots for the uh, the achievement. You ain't got shit, buddy. Oh. Damn. Well, that's pretty good. The the bazooka shot was just like, what the hell, man? Come on. Oh. A side quest has opened up. Oh, it's way it's way too far away. I'm gonna keep on with the main story. And then later in the, maybe tomorrow or something, we'll come back through and we'll do side quests and all that crazy shit. Elixir? I wonder if your progress of your snowmobile carries over to the time attack, because then it would be really important. Uh, I think I'll pick up this one. Oh, what's going on? Oh, is that a gate? Okay. Dude, I'm loving it. I'm really having fun so far. Let's do this. Ooh, big machinery. Oh shit! Wow. Okay. That hurt. It'd be nice if you didn't have to go scoped on the um, submachine gun. That's, that shit's not working. I'm gonna have to get a bazooka for those guys. Take out the fuel tanks, hopefully. Oh. Holy shit! That hurts. Okay, so this guy, I can get him over here, maybe? Sorry, Aaron Aon. That did like no damage at all. Okay, what do we got? Do the high wind. Yeah, it should have knockdown as well on it. No Aranea. <laughs> she smashed it. I shot it in the foot. <laughs> Good stuff. Man, Arane is so cool. Okay, we need another weapon. There we go. But this bazooka kind of... <laughs> awesome, man. She's got warp strikes. Boom. Take that, buddy. It looks like arena has got warp strikes now. She was totally warp striking, like red warp strikes. Anything in around here? No. We haven't really got some... Uh any of the data files recently. <laughs> There's an ebony machine out here. Yeah, we'll definitely rest. <laughs> that is a great shot, man. That's really cool. Yes. Man, there's gonna be so much fan fiction coming out of this. Horrible, horrible fan fiction. If anybody gives Aranea a penis, I'll be very upset. Yeah, that makes... Actually, she if she's Reb Warp Striking, maybe she is Arden. But then Arden would have no reason to motivate... According to my intel, their house... Motivate Pompto, none. It's some kind of Magitek armor, right? What's so new about it? This one's got a ghost in the machine. Chief Pasithia himself. Managed to fuse his soul ah. with the core. Maybe this is that monkey one that we've seen that's kind of the swinging this guy through the rafters. If we don't take him out now, 
He's liable to destroy the whole world. Man, she's doing the right thing by having like really warm clothes on, but then she leaves her zip like halfway down. <laughs> I'm not complaining, I'm just saying, you know, maybe she'd be a bit warmer if she didn't do that. Attention research chief Bastille. It has come to my attention that uh, Glacian's recent assault was quelled by your Magitech infantry. As commendation for your service to our great nation, I have approved your petition to increase funding for your research. Your work is the centrifugal force. Centrifugal? Fugal? Sorry, it's like 2 a.m. here. That will propel the Empire beyond our borders to greatness on the world stage. I eagerly await further reports of your progress. And that's from the Emperor, Aldercap. I've been assigned to Chief Bethista's. I'm not even going to attempt to say that, lab. Not many people can say they've worked under the supervision of a living legend. I mean, this is the guy who saved the Empire from an eternal winter. He's practically our saver. Savior. It looks like Eternal Winter out there. Basithia is his name. Sorry. I'm gonna keep on crapping that up. My boss pulled me aside today to issue me a special task. Said it's highly confidential and that I'm the only one qualified for the job. But how? I barely even know my way around the compound. Well, whatever this task is, I'm, I'll deal with it in the morning. Yeah, you're gonna be a ghost in the machine soon, mate. I found out what my special task is today, and frankly, I wish I hadn't. If only I could unsee the things I saw today. I really ought to eat something before I go to bed, but that shit totally killed my appetite. I had the honor of seeing His Imperial Majesty in person today. To think his radiance would travel all that way through the ice and snow just to observe our progress. If the Emperor is putting in all this faith in Magitek, then so should I. Just my luck, one of the... Plasmodian samples started leaking, and yours truly was the one blessed with the privilege of cleaning it up. And then my boss had the nerve to yell at me, as if the whole thing were my fault. If he wants to criticize the real culprit, he ought to look in a mirror. Dang. You better look in a mirror, son. Pick, pick, what was that pick it sound? up. Our cue to go. Oh, the alarm's going off. Come on, Prompto, just pick up the item, please, mate. Plagued with the jump, the jump bug. I know I can hold it down to pick him up, but still, I just want to tap the button. Proposal for Operation Countersign, ME755IX18. As Deputy High Commander, I hereby propose, hereby propose a large-scale assault on the Lucian capital of Insomnia. Preparations are to begin next month. Hmm. Our future is far too precious to entrust to our enemy. We must retrieve the crystal and ring of a legend. The ring of the Lucii? Only then shall we shall our world know true peace. Deputy High Commander Ravis Nox Fleuret, which is um, Luna Freya's brother. Target detected. Eliminate Target immediately. Detected. Commence elimination of compromised unit. Compromised unit is what they're calling us now. Where's our an airplane? Holy shit, she just jumped right up there. I suppose she's a good dragoon, that's what she does, so. I don't need that rifle right now. I need some feet down. Come on! Get some crack shots on these guys. I know it's not very efficient, but I want to get my crack shots off. Because I need that achievement. I don't want to come back and get it. Who killed her? I guess Aranea did. Nope. Take that, buddy. No, we're actually taking. Whoa, holy shit! See Aranea going skits? Oh, that's a. Don't blow it up! Yeah, that does way too much damage. Okay, let's get a selfie going too. <laughs> it's cool that they kind of stop and pose for it a little bit. Gotcha. Look at that, buddy. What's that? Lumen Flare? Yeah. Watch this. Aranea was doing skits, doing flips and shit everywhere. Awesome, man. They're natural. Those things are everywhere. Okay, I can't really do it for these ones. Huh? 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 
Oh, his helmet came off then too. Buzz off! Shoot, right? Oh shit, look at that! Lazy beams. Okay, how are, oh, he's healing up too. How are we gonna do that? <laughs> I really want her her skills now. Just taking a shot at Aranea. Oh, I totally have to get a selfie with Aranea. Selfie, man. I didn't think I'd ever be saying that so much in a Final Fantasy game. Oh, I do not want to be around that. Oh, go up there, Prompto. <laughs> They blow up really hard. Yeah, sorry, Aranea. What else have we got? More probes? <laughs> I'm doing that for the achievement. I know it does nothing. Achievement? Oh, I'm not the fucking skids, man. Alright, the sniper rifle would be way better than that. Um. Do we have one? No, flares. What do we got? Sniper? No, Rapidus. Sniper? Yep. This should be a lot better. Alright! Well, oh, the reloads on it are really good. Where else have we got one? Here? Oh, there was only one of them. Crap. Ah, oh, so the weapon weapon caches look like they have limited amount of ammo on them. I don't think they would. Bazooka, yeah. <laughs> Lexi, how... wait, sorry. Hefka, how do you know that? Have you already done this? Nine 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 nine, wicked. G'day to everyone in the chat, by the way. Thanks for joining me in this. I can't take much more. Ooh. Can we? Yeah, we're totally yeah. shooting this dude. Oh, <laughs> it did like no damage to him. Uh, I, maybe that's probably not a good idea to run down there. Oh, there's yeah. weapons down there though. Oh, well. Holy shit. We need replacement weapons over here. So yeah, I've been going for like an hour and a half already. So it's a decent chunk of um, the DLC has already got a decent chunk to it. And we haven't even done bonus modes yet. I gotta take some selfies. Yeah, hello opening. I haven't, I still haven't heard Hello Opening. I'm disappointed actually. Oh, that is totally a missed story. No! Oh well, this doesn't work in my favour then. <laughs> nice, you can double crack shot them. Who is shooting bloody rockets at me? Oh, old man there. Old man. Okay, I surely only need a couple more crash shots. I must be getting close to the, uh... Close to the achievement. I don't know how I'm going to take out that big dude. Though. Maybe I can get Aaron A to do it. Dragoon guy? Oh, wicked. Oh, then he takes vulnerable damage. Alright, that'll work. Uh, we don't really need players. Have we got a bazooka anyway? No. Oh, 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 where's our air? I gotta get the selfie <laughs> of his uh, robot crotch. And then I'll wait. Pretty much wait for Aranea's, um... There we go. Nice. No more selfies. Get out of there, mate. Don't get cooked. Get back. Get... 
hadn't done it, unfortunately. Holy crap! Uh, that hurt a little bit. Uh, just give me one sec. Dick. Um, yeah. No son. Damage. Crack shot. It's over. Got him. Yeah, that's not too bad. So you have to use your um. Oh, we got a sniper on us too. Far out. Just smash me. Sniper still up there? Yeah. Not the best shot though. Uh, what do we get to kill him? We got nothing. Alright, I'm gonna have to go up to the balcony and take him out. Uh, I don't know if I'll be doing Horizon Zero Dawn today, mate. It's like 2am here, so... And I haven't slept yet, so... Um, yeah. I'm thinking this is probably gonna go on for about another half hour, too, so... I don't think I'll get around to playing Horizon Zero Dawn today. I should be able to reach this guy out here, right? Bastard. Oh, Take that. Proceed through the laboratory. Not half bad. <laughs> she did all the that work, really. One. Yeah, again, for anyone wondering, it is the 27th here in uh, in Australia at the moment. That's why we have the uh, the update. Katie Grant, yeah, I'll see how the day goes, mate. It depends when I wake up. I'm guessing my daughter's probably going to wake me up at like 6am anyway, so we'll see what happens. Ooh, Ebony. Is Ebony really that good? Yes. Research log here, 724, day 297. Mass production of a Magitek infantry was a success. We've overwhelmed the Lucians with our numbers and surrounded Insomnia. But to rest on our laurels now would be unthinkable. On occasion, harvesting the plasmodic miasma produces some side effects. Mm. The demons born of this process have been disposed of on sight. Until now. How foolish I was to let these sublime creatures go to waste. What they lack in adaptability, they make up for in sheer power. I realize now that I ought to channel my efforts into exploring the true potential of these demons for the sake of the Empire. He's slipping. Perhaps this has been my true calling all along. He's mad. <sighs> this guy has completely lost his mind. Yeah, well, I think he did that a long time ago. Did I see Sarah Hip's name in the chat? G'day, Sarah Hips. We'll take a rest. Excuse me. Yeah, Aranea can't die. No way. If they ever make a Final Fantasy 15 2, I reckon it'll be Aranea, Cindy, and Luna Freya, and they'll do like a um a Final Fantasy 10 2 type of thing with uh, dress spheres and all that shit. I, I mean, it'll never happen, but, you know. It must be close. I feel like we're coming towards the end, surely. After several years of experimentation... Ooh, this looks like the, um, the, in, the monkey type one. We have finally succeeded in fusing Mammal and Magitek. Although we are still conducting various tests on codename Barbarus. The unit should be functional enough to fend off would-be intruders until the development finishes on unit XD1002, Immortalis. Ooh. Research log year 756, day 190. At long last, my life's work is complete. Not only have I found a way to preserve the ego, I've also managed to sustain that consciousness through the sublimation process and transfer it into my Magitek Trooper. Mm. The prototype has proven slightly less powerful than the diamond weapon. 
but this presents no real problem. Oh, no shit, the dino After weapon's all, huge. Sorry, I think the stream is being a bit weird right now. Hopefully it's reconnected. Anyway, uh, Clowns Gameplays TM. Uh, donated, I think, two rupees? Is that right? Two dollars? In Rupal or Rupee? Anyway, he says, Hail, good afternoon. I'm from Brazil. Well, g'day from Australia, mate. Thanks for joining the stream, man. Thanks very much for the super chat. Yeah, I'm in Australia, that's why I've got it early. It's the 27th here. Ooh! The big ass gorilla yeti thing? An abdom abominable snowman? Oh, dude, he's crazy. He's gonna beat the shit out of me. Aranea is gonna do all the work in this fight, I know it. Yeah, he's taking no damage. Okay, we can blow up these next to him. But otherwise, I think Aranea is going to be doing a lot. Did that do any damage to him? I don't think so. Yeah. Or maybe very little. I could probably use Star Shell, but I'm going to save it up for Aranea's. Um, Aranea's tech. That seems to be pretty good. Yeah, we'll do the Dragoon oh, dive. Oh, is he gonna get him though? Totally missed. Did it? Yeah, I think it totally missed. Get down there, you bastard. Shoot him in the crotch. Probably his face is more effective. Is there any weapons I can pick up? Yeah, alright. Get it, get it, get it. Oh, it's a sniper beam too, or a sniper rifle, sorry. Maybe we have to shoot his hands or something. Yeah, let's get him down. Nice. So this guy shoot his hands when he's on the roof and I'll knock him down. And you can get some uh, vulnerable shots on him. Go. Good damage. Oh, he's got critical as well. Dang. Got the yellow version. Okay, face shot. Wicked man. I'm digging this boss. Hopefully see it in the main game as like a time quest or something. Oh shit. That's not good. That's doing hardly anything to him. Look at that combo. Man. Go Aaron Eye. Do it, do it. I love her, man. I love fighting with her. It's great. Oh, I missed out on my crack shot. Okay, I wonder if we can knock him off with the normal... Oh, shit. <laughs> I think I need the sniper to knock him off, actually. Oh, that's really good damage. Go around here, go. Dragoon died. She's carrying our ass at the moment, totally. Ah, oh, he gets up way too fast now. Damn. Sarah Hips, thank you very much for the, um, the $10 donation there, or Super Chat, thanks. I will read it in one second, as soon as I'm getting my ass non-beat. No! I'm waiting for him to go up in the air, but it doesn't look like he'll do that in this phase. It's really, really encouraging to see a multi-phase fight in a in Final Fantasy XV. 
of course, when I run out of ammo, he jumps on the roof. Yeah. Holy shit. Um, because generally, most of the fights are just like one phase, they don't really shift all that often. So maybe, I hope that's a trend they're going towards. Down, down. He should be close. I'll tap the button as soon as she gets in. Yeah, got him. Not very big damage. Oh, far out. Thought I was doing pretty good up until that point. It seems kind of like at the moment it's a lot of waiting around Let's for the text to come up. Unless I'm just doing it wrong. No, using RNA is never doing it wrong. <laughs> Boom. Keep going. I don't really know how I got hit then. Oh, am I down? Holy shit, that's the first time I've been down. Not like this. <laughs> and oh, far out. I think only a couple of shots and it'll be dead. Oh, was that in the face? No. Aaron A will finish him off. We'll wait for her to just take him out. Oh. He won't be able to hit me. I was gonna say he won't be able to hit me behind the hole, pole, but no. Oh. Aranea wins the day again. That music was kick-ass. <sighs> Made it out alive. Oh. Oh, what's going on? Unit XDA-10002. Immortalis. Immortalis. Plasmodic miasma transfer complete. No psychic obstructions detected. All systems operational. Activating Immortalis. Okay. It's outside. We're gonna have to kill our father. Oh, dude, this is like a massive tunnel boring machine. It's something like out of uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. So that's the new model, and that means he must be inside that thing. <laughs> that is crazy. How are we gonna kill Hop that? On. I guess. Oh, <laughs> a Gatlin gun. We get that. We get. Ready for round two? <laughs> you bet! Sarah Hips, wish I could stay. Need some happy fun times with the cow crew. Gotta go though. Oh, Thanks, Calendor. Hopefully to see you again. Oh, Sarah, if you're still there, I hope everything works now, out for you. All shall tremble before me, man and maker alike. Use the machine gun to take down the unit in Mortalis. If Pumpto is overtaken, the game will be over. Ah, okay. Aim, zoom in out, fire, okay. Can I shoot his little thing with things? Really oh, yeah. That maniac's taken biological oh, warfare to the next level. Okay, he's protected anywhere that's not red, I guess. Then I want to be the one to take him down. Oh, I should down be below. shooting him down below. Oh shit. I suppose we have to hit him in enormous. the little noodly things out in front. Rise and shine, shortcake. <laughs> Rise and shine, shortcake. Ah, oh, Aaron. Oh, it's pretty hard to control. It's like bopping up and down all the time. Incoming! Wow, this is intense. Looks like he's gonna take Force ages. Your to knees kill. before me. <laughs> Zoom in on that shit. Zoom in on that bar. Oh, we're getting criticals because we're hitting him straight in the face. Oh, that looks really good. Oh, shit, we're on. No. Oh, damn, where is it? Can't see shit. Oh, there we go. Oh, what was that? 
was he hit by something or was that oh yeah we took out the main eye oh he's pissed now vulnerable this is cool i'm pumped i'm liking it thank god you don't have to reload or anything like. I suppose they can't make it too hard because like RPG players probably don't know for much about first person shooters or anything. Oh, he's coming back. How can this be? <laughs> I will not do you reckon RNA is gonna do a dragoon dive into it and take it out? I think I should take out his little, little doodle eyes up there. Not very vulnerable. Okay. Whoa, the the kid's super hard to control right now. Super hard to control his shaky ass. Okay, I guess we just gotta keep focusing on his uh center right. Alright. Seems a bit I'm not gonna say too easy, because as soon as I do that, that shit'll game over. chances a human. He just did himself over big time. Oh. Come on. Oh. oh, he's getting closer. We're going to be overrun. I don't think I did enough to kill him. He's totally going to kill us. He's got us. It's game over. Oh, shit. <laughs> Close, man. Yeah, he's done. Oh, that was intense. It would have been much cooler if there was a diamond weapon chasing us, though. That that shit would have been awesome. That would have been real cool. You all right? Yeah, this is what I wanted. Then say it like you mean it. You did good, kid. <laughs> you did good, kid. Could have done it without you, girl. <laughs> Seriously, though. <laughs> what was that? That was super awkward. Well, I better catch up with Noct and the guys. He's got a lot on his plate. And I figure he could probably use a hand, taking back the crystal and all that. And who knows? Maybe I'll take it back before he does. <laughs> don't get ahead of yourself. Honestly, I don't know for sure if they're going to accept me for who I really am. But I'll never know if I don't speak up. So I'm gonna tell him. After all, it's my life to live. A boy has become a man. <laughs> anyway, Grawly is straight ahead. This can't be the end. Because he gets kidnapped. So it cannot be the end. Aranea. Surely. Yeah? Thanks. Danke schön. That outfit, man. I want it. Off. That can't be it. <laughs> Classic, man. No, that can't be it, though. But 
That doesn't make any sense. Though. Because we meet, um... We meet up with Prompto again, and he's, like, kidnapped in the base. Like, he's been, like, tortured and messed with. That doesn't make sense, does it? Am I wrong? I don't think it makes sense. Anyway... Well, here we are. He's in the to torture thing. I think we're gonna get an episode Ignis, um... ...thing coming up. So what I'm actually gonna do... I'm gonna turn off chat and my camera for now. And we're gonna have a look at... see if we get the teaser. Um, what am I doing? This and that. Because if the teaser comes up, I want to have it, like, full on. Anyway, what do you guys think? I thought that was pretty good. Um, but it, the end, I... I don't get the end. I really don't. Yeah, in chapter 13, he is bloody messed up, man. Like here, you see him. How did he end up there? Yeah, Arden didn't... I don't think Arden was Araneo. They were in like two different locations. I want to know how he got captured though. I mean, he just took out an entire base, and Immortalis, how did he get captured? Whatever. Who cares? Well, he's looking pretty busted up, though. Yeah, it had to be Arden that captured him, surely. No one else would have the power to do it. Oh, Iggy with his walking stick. Poor dude. It would just be so shitty for Prompto. He's like, yeah, I can do anything. I'm a new man and I'm going to tell them. And then he gets kidnapped and he'd be like, oh, shit. And I hope I don't get a copyright strike for this this song. Ugh. Oh well, let's find out, huh? I, I I enjoyed it. I thought it was quite good. Teaser? <gasps> God damn it! I'm sorry. For what? For falling right into his trap? And for hurting you like that? I know, right? How could you possibly do such a horrible thing? After everything we've been through. Nah. It's okay. You're not the only one who fell for it. Once this is all over, I say we break down the borders, come together as one nation. Huh? I mean, what does it matter where you're from, anyway? You know, I never thought I'd say this, but you sounded like a real king for a second. Better late than never. I'm gonna make this world a better place. You with me? Uh-huh. Ever at your side. Hmm. Okay. Kind of sounds like something Katy Perry would say, but... Um, touching, nonetheless.
Dudes. Dudes. I wonder what he said. The 12th. Wow, it's not out till December. Wow. So there you go. It took me an hour and 49 minutes to finish. That's pretty chunky. I like it. That's good. So just so there's no confusion, Arden at the end didn't... You couldn't hear what he said. It was uh, nothing. So... Um, I wonder what he said. I wonder how important it's going to be. Awesome. Ah, that's cool. Um, everyone was joking about like Ignis having like cooking with Ignis or something like that. But his looks like it might be really, really dark as well. Shit, man. I'm pretty pumped about that. I think it's going to be good. I won't share my certificate, but anyway. Unlock time trial mode. Unlock intensive training. Acquired the lion heart. Oh, somebody said before. I don't, I think it was Kefka. Um, lion heart, the, is that the gun blade from Final Fantasy VIII? And learn the trigger happy bullet art. Did we just get the gun blade? That would be friggin' awesome. Wow, you received the Tundra attire for Prompto. Change into your new outfit and let the cold know it never bothered you anyway. <laughs> That's a Frozen reference. The cold never bothered me anyway. I, I sing it far better than the Frozen. So it just gives us the costume and it just gives us the, the gun blade. We don't even have to work for it. Huh. Dude, we've got the we've got the lion heart. That's um Wait, it doesn't look quite like the lion heart though. That's um Squall's weapon from Final Fantasy VIII. Holy shit. It doesn't have the blade on it though, it's just a gun, it looks like. Wow. Okay, I think intensive training is fighting against Aranea. Do you wanna check it out? Or have we been going too long? Far out, man. It's half past two here. Um, fuck it. Let's go. Should we do intensive training? Yes. Yes, we will. Spar against the Imperial Dragoon and experience the true thrill of combat. Begin playing. Yeah, if anyone caught that, it looks like we have to wait till December to get episode Ignis. December? That's like six months away. That can't be right. Usually it's like three months in between. Unless the big announcement they're going to make is that we're going to get another character episode in between. I don't know. It seems really odd. I don't know. That's really strange. Why would it be six months away? Yeah. Anyway. Cool, man. I'm, I'm liking the little teaser for episode Ignis. Uh, does it have trophies? Uh, the DLC does have trophies, yeah. I've already got three of them, I think. There's only six in total, I believe. Now, Ooh. let's see what you can do. And Bring it she's going to beat the shit out of me. Oh, fuck. <laughs> she's already beating the shit out of me. Wow. Uh, I can't do anything right now. There must be... Holy crap. There must be some way I can, like... Okay, so we gotta blow up barrels and stuff around her. That's not gonna work. Oh. Oh, damn. I guess we have to shoot her out of that, maybe. And we can shoot a lance as well. We're trigger happy. I'm gonna save my shit up for that. Oh. She's got a lot of HP too. <laughs> Holy crap. Kang a Bing. Sorry if that's not the right pronunciation, but thank you very much for the $10, mate. Thank you. Okay, let's do trigger happy. 
Oh. Oh, wait. It didn't, it didn't do much. Maybe I didn't press the button rapid enough or something. I gotta use your mixer. I am sucking right now, by the way. Far out. Okay. I am not doing good. Did that hit her? No, I didn't. Crap. Wow, she's really, really hard to hit. Yeah, thank you, gang. Thanks very much for the donation, mate. Take this. Yeah, so you must have to do something with her in the air. I'm guessing you're probably gonna have to hit her with the um, the machine gun while she's in the air. Dude, she is wrecking me. Can we hit her with the baton? At all? Oh yeah. Oh nice, crack shots. It's over. And then some trigger happy action. Dude, come on. Really? In the complete wrong direction. Oh well. I would blame Tom though, but I know it's my fault. Did I get her? No. The it's really, it's kind of hard to control him in this. He has odd tracking with his moves. Yeah, this is going to be a hard one to beat. I can't do anything right now. <laughs> yeah, this is going to take a bit of training to beat her in this. For sure. Big crack shot made. I got no restorative, so I can't do shit. No! Please, babe. I'm sure someone can make a meme like when Bay is angry or some shit. Oh wow, Bazooka. No. She's gonna do that move and I'm not gonna be able to snap her out of it. Oh yeah, that's how you do it. Boom! What is she doing? She's fucking up. Oh, no. Limit strike. Or limit break or whatever. Holy fuck. I'm done. It was close though. Pretty good for a first effort, I reckon. Wow. Cool. Alright. Get good, yeah. <laughs> I need to get good, actually. Uh, I'm gonna give that one more shot. I guess a lot of people don't know I'm from Australia. Most people think I'm from um, England or something, I guess. That wasn't too bad. I um, Next time I'll try and shoot her out of the sky a bit more and it shouldn't be a problem. But... I used to be a Dark Soul player, or I played the Dark Souls game, and often when you go in blind, you get your first attempt as your best attempt, and then you can never match it for like another now, 30 attempts. Let's so see what you can do. We'll see how this one Bring goes. It on. Shoot, buddy. So we're just going to have to watch out for her uh, air jump thingy. Dude, <laughs> he totally... the tracking is really off. It just kind of misses sometimes. I, it's hard to explain. She just dodges everything, the crazy bitch. Her recovery is way too good. No, oh, get out of there, Pompto! No! 
crap. See, I'm doing way worse than I was last time. Go, <laughs> mate, go. Is she dodging all that shit? Got you in my sights. God damn. She can dodge like everything. You bitch. Go, crackers. Cool man, he kind of like flings the bullet. Yeah, got a nice man. I like it. Crack shots. Yes. Die. That's a bit rough, mate. I wonder what Starshell if it does anything at all. Oh man, not going good this time. Her recovery is way too quick. I don't know what to do about She's just going skits on me. Uh, not good. I'll try and get some barrel action on it. Got No one your nice guy. Should be able to get a crack shot down on her when she's like that. Dude, where's my crack shots? Oh, well, whatever. I don't know when's a good Done. I'm done. I got nothing else. <laughs> the dubstep kicks in. I can't do anything until I get... Can I use my Phoenix Knight? Oh, mate. Smash her. Beat her like your de facto partner. Alright. No, she's already into it. Holy shit. I guess you just gotta skirt around her until uh, Trigger Happy comes out. Maybe. I don't know. Otherwise, she's just way too fast. Oh. Chick, let me get up. Come on. Oh, nice. That was pretty good timing of that one, actually. Did I get her? Yeah. What? Why? Uh, anyway, whatever. It happened. Now she's going skits mode. This is probably a good time to do the um, bazooka attack, I guess. I don't know how to stop this. Oh, nice. I think I avoided. Take this. It didn't give me the cue to stop it. Bullshit. Oh wait. Oh well, whatever. Um, I don't think I'm gonna be able to beat her tonight. It's like 2.30 in the morning, so. <laughs> Holy fuck, she stabbed me straight in the thingy. Anyway, we're, I'll take a look at the time trial quickly, and then I think I'll wrap up the stream. We've seen the bulk of it anyway, so... And I'm pretty keen to go to bed and then wake up in the morning and start pumping out videos as well. I'm a little bit disappointed that they just straight up gave us the outfit and the gun. I was hoping we'd have to do time trials and stuff for it. Anyway, we'll take a look at the time trial. And then... After I do the time trial, I'm going to go into the main game and see if we unlocked it in the main game. 
Slippery Slalom, Slalom, uh, Avalanche Ambush, and Snow Glide Run. Let's go Slalom. <laughs> she looked like a pole dancer for a moment on the spear. <laughs> She fights is based on other dragoons in the past games. Yeah, the whole um, the jump and the dive and everything. See you, Kefka. I'm going to try out this trial mode and then I'll go into the main game and check if it transferred over and then, then I'm done. But for everyone that's still in chat, thank you heaps for stopping by. Really, thanks, thanks very much for checking out the stream and uh, giving me a lot of support. Geordie, thanks for stopping by, mate. I'm sorry if I missed any of you guys in chat. I hope you don't think I'm some type of asshole, but I don't usually get this many people in my live streams. So, um, yeah, I'm quite th thankful for it, but I missed a lot of the chat. So, yeah, but I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you uh, enjoyed the story. I know I, ha I had fun, so, yeah. I think it's pretty good. Like, we got about an hour and 50 minutes out of this. I'm sure you probably could have done it faster, but also you have to remember that we did no side quests. We did like one side quest. So there is a lot more to the game I think that you can get. Oops. Shit. Wow. These, it, this is incredibly hard to control. It looks like the speed upgrades have been fully maxed on this one. It's way faster than the one I played in the campaign. <laughs> Shit, man, it's really hard to control. Compared to the, um, yeah, compared to the campaign one, it's way different. Oh. I think this one's fully upgraded with the CPU chips. It feels that way. That's another thing to remember. Like, we didn't upgrade the snowmobile at all in the, um, in the story, so I still have to go back and do all that as well. So I think if you wanted to, you could probably squeeze like three hours or something out of the um, the DLC, maybe. I I'm not going too well right now. Oh shit! <laughs> oh, this is not how you slalom. This is definitely not. Okay, not too bad. I didn't do all that good, but at least I finished. Oh, snowboarding in Final Fantasy VII. I totally forgot that that was in there. Uh, Anti-2B. If I was to rate it out of 10. The story itself, I'd give it like an 8 or a 9 maybe. Just like... Can... It's a DLC, like, you know, I think it did very good to expand upon Prompto's character. But as far as the combat and stuff goes, um, I don't know, man. Uh, five or six, it wasn't all that great, but interesting. Man, we suck. Well, I suck. I definitely have to try better at that one. Anyway, that's. I think that's basically what Time Attack's going to be about. Uh, the Sampa, it's only available in Australia at this point. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the main game and see if we unlock the costume and the gun for the main game. It didn't really say anything about it carrying across the main game, so maybe we still have to do the time trial to unlock it. I'm really not sure, but we'll have a look. Yeah, Joe, there's uh, there's three courses. You have to finish all three of them to get a um, to get a trophy. And you also have to kill the Kaiser Behemoth, which I think is a side quest. Anyway, we'll load up my game, which takes like 42 hours now for some reason. Um, it didn't say we've unlocked special bonuses though, which it usually does. I feel like we haven't unlocked it in the main game. I could be wrong, but we'll see. Jason Martin, cow, you rule, brother. Thanks, mate. Of course I'm going to read that out. Come on. <laughs> yeah, thanks, man. Thanks for stopping by the stream. Uh, I'm just looking through the chat here, see what's going on. Yeah, but it's like 2.40 here. 
And my daughter will probably wake up in about three hours and just be like, and that'll be my sleep gone. So, yeah. (laughs) Um, Japanese character name guy. I forgot what you asked me to call you, but um, are you not in Japan at the moment? Brandon Callum, no, it's not open world, mate. Um, it's open suburb, I guess. Um, although the actual the story is linear, uh, you can do these side quests that appear during certain times of the day. So you've got some freedom to walk around the snowy fields and check out different um, different side quests. So it's it has some sort of open world element in, to it. It's way less linear than uh, episode uh, Gladio was. So, yeah. Okay, so we'll check and see if they gave us the um, the Gunblade or the Lionheart, as they're calling it. Did we get his outfit? We did. Tundra attire. Wow, that was. I'm kind of disappointed in how how easy it was to unlock. I was hoping to do guides and stuff on it, but it looks like I won't have to. Anyway, and we got the Lionheart. A high-performance prototype firearm developed exclusively for high-ranking officials. De- deals more damage when HP is low. It's got plus 9 to strength and plus 14 to spirit. How? Where do they get these stats from? Like, how does that make any sense? Anyway, we'll check it and see if it has a unique ca- uh, gun model. It does. It's not quite the it's not quite the gun blade. It's not quite the lion heart, but it's kind of there. I wish they had to put the little blade on the end. It. I like it. It's a unique model. It looks kind of cool. But as far as attack goes, it's very very weak, actually. Unless it's really good at low HP, like unless it gets a big damage boost. The thing is with Prompto, on my gameplay anyway, he's either always dead or has very low HP. So this one might make a lot of sense for him. <laughs> cool. So now we have Gladiolus's rugged attire and we have um, Prompto's arctic attire. So we just need Ignis all dressed up and it'll look pretty good. G'day Somnus Ultima, how you doing? Yeah, you're quite late actually, about uh, two and a half hours late. <laughs> so yeah, this we're in the middle of the desert and Prompto is fully geared. He does look good though, he looks ridiculous, but he looks good, you know? I've already finished with the DLC, actually we just finished up, I'm about to close down the stream actually. <laughs> Sorry about that. But Prompto, wow. Let's, uh, we'll do a couple of jumps before I uh, fully log off, eh? So this is a new Regalia no Type roads, D, in no case rules. you haven't seen it. And no one to hold us back. Noctis's um, Magitech, no, sorry, Noctis's suit does give a slight ribbon effect. I don't think it's a fully, fully ribbon effect, but yeah. Cindy, you have seriously so outdone yourself. Yeah, Golden as. I never thought I'd see the day. <laughs> and yet, here we are. But Prompto in his snowsuit. Well, what are we weird, waiting man. for? Let's take your first weird. spin. It's strange. It does look cool, but it just it's ridiculous in this hot, in this heat. Just ridiculous. But then everything they wear is completely ridiculous. So <laughs> Them laughing gets really repetitive really quickly. Oh. All right. <laughs> Are they gonna take a selfie? No. See you later, Ben Snatch. Oh shit, we landed on top of him. <laughs> Bloody all this is going on. That music, man, such great music. Anyway, um, that is the DLC. Whoops. 
taking a walk on the wild side? Nothing like nature in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> that gold car is too much, man. It's way too much. It's just crazy shit. Anyway, here's us three looking very spick in our uh, getup. Wicked. Good stuff. Rate the DLC on a scale of 1 to 10. Uh, I'll give it about an 8, I guess. Just off the top of, the, um, the top of my head. So, it's pretty good. I really enjoyed it. It's really quite good. Anyway guys, I I really have to go to uh, to bed now. It's like nearly 3 o'clock here, 3 a.m. So yeah, but thank you very much for joining in. I really, I love the support from you guys. And if you ever see me doing a stream in the future, even if it's not a game that you're really into, jump into the stream and we can chat about whatever you want. Final Fantasy 15, uh, whatever game I'm playing, whatever. It's um, This is pretty much the only way I have to connect to you subscribers, so I definitely want to do that more. So jump into the screen um, streams and uh, yeah. But definitely look out and hit that notification little icon thing because I'm going to be doing guides and uh, whatever I can with episode prompto over the next uh, week or so. You'll probably be like, man, fuck this cow. I just, I hope he stops posting videos soon. But yeah, hopefully not. Hopefully you enjoy it. Anyway, guys, again, thank you very much for your support. Uh, I really, really appreciate it. None of this would be possible without you guys. So thank you very much. Um... I'll give a sum up of the whole episode tomorrow when I get a bit of time. I'll make a uh, review on it, give it a score, all that type of stuff. So keep a lookout for that. In the meantime, if you like this video, please leave a thumbs up. If you've got any comments or suggestions, then leave them in the comment section below. And if you haven't subscribed already, then please do so. Just before I go, I want to shout out to Lil Kidder, who gave me a super chat of $10. Uh, Clowns Gameplay TN, which gave me a donation of $2. Still much appreciated. Sarah Hips gave me ten dollars. Uh, all the best for you, Sarah. I hope your stress passes soon. And Ken uh, Ken Abing, which uh, he gave me ten dollars as well. Sorry, he she. I'm not sure. But thank you very much. The donations mean a huge amount. So thank you, thank you very much. Anyway, guys, this has been Lemon Eating Cow. Moo. Thanks for watching.